in the state um, this morning following a tip off that uh, we received yesterday from the public we managed to nab uh, three individuals who have been part of a syndicate that has been stealing medicine and uh, non-pharmaceutical supplies for our people um, I think you all saw that a week ago we flagged off uh, supplies worth 244 million shillings to all the facilities in Nairobi County. Um, these facilities have not had drugs for years. Uh, the last time Nairobi had a supply from Kemsa was 2020. And uh, that was because of a long-standing debt of 185 million, where we have come into an agreement, we already paid around 80 million shillings, and we are sorting that out monthly. And there was a lot of hope when we went, I went across facilities. There was a lot of hope and enthusiasm by the general public who when they go to our facilities and get treated are then told Akuna Dawa and Onue Dawa Kule Inje and sometimes you find there's a connection between that chemist and the person who is sending you there. Sometimes I don't want to accuse people uh, blindly. They have been using ambulances an ambulance leaves a facility it is full of drugs. These drugs are then sold to private practitioners who are selling them in the chemists. We want to sound a warning, and I'm glad I've had a discussion this morning with the DCI, Mr. Amin. Uh, I've spoken to the regional uh, command of police and my security teams, that even as these three give us the entire value chain of who they work with from inside the facilities to the market, if anybody knows that this is what they've been doing, if I was them, I would completely get out of that business. These drugs are what will save people's lives. In fact, it is a curse for you to steal what is meant for the poor, to save lives. Those we have found will be an example. They will be a serious, strong example to those who have been in this habit and this business. Please stop it and don't do it. In any county, we saw another case in Kisi. On Friday, we caught a nurse in Nairobi doing the same. It is deeply immoral and we will not relent. Even as we strengthen our systems, our HMIS, which is Health Management Information System, our stock systems, just basic decency. You're stealing from the poor an issue of life and death, which is Madawa. How come? We have lacked scruples, Kabisa. You know? So in Nairobi, we will not allow it. And I want to warn anyone involved, no one will protect you. Whether you're an officer within my county, whether you're an external party, no matter your designation, no matter your position, no one will be protected. And there will be no sacred cows in this. So, Jana, Kuna. Together with the help of the around, so we have them. Jose. 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 J